Richmond family says they are out of tens of thousands of dollars after a home remodeling company abruptly closed. Thanks for joining us. I'm Leland Pinder and I'm Julie Bragg. Problem solver Maggie Marshall spoke to them tonight and found out they are not alone. She joins us now live Maggie. Hey, Julie, I'm outside of Fabling built a remodeling company out of Henrico and you can see that they have erased their sign that was here on their glass door and while they may be, have been able to erase that people are calling on them to hand over the money they say they're owed for the projects that have not been completed. Wooden planks, trash bags and a wheelbarrow full of pillows are just some of the materials scattered in one Richmond family's yard. It's a garbage dump. A backyard in disarray that was supposed to have been turned into a dream backyard fit with a finished deck, railing, patio and grass for their kids and dogs to play. Very torn up backyard. Our deck was not done. It was the framing was done, but you could not exit the back of my house and my children could not go outside. My dogs cannot go outside. The Richmond homeowners who asked to remain anonymous say they didn't think twice about using Fabling Built to complete the project. They are a Henrico contracting company run by Casey and Adrian Fabling since 2016. We interviewed clients that he had done projects for previously. We heard nothing but great things, so we felt we were choosing wisely. But they became concerned when the project manager went radio silent in early March. We stopped hearing from him, so I started to worry. When they finally got a hold of him, what they were told caught them off guard. He let me know that the project was not going to finish because Casey Fabling had gone bankrupt and um, some of the employees weren't being paid and that our materials that we had paid to have ordered were not going to be here and that the labor that we had paid for was not going to happen. The homeowners had just made their last payment on the $65,000 project. They made calls to get answers with no luck and say they soon learned they were not alone in this situation. There's a lot of people that are hurt in this situation. Give someone that money and they don't show up and complete the work. It leaves you feeling helpless. Henrico police say they are currently investigating the owners for fraud after receiving several reports. The Fablings are also facing numerous lawsuits in the Henrico court system for people trying to collect debt they claim they owe. As of now, they have not legally filed for bankruptcy. CBS 6 has attempted numerous times over the last week to get a hold of the Fablings for comment on the situation. They also tried to reach out to them at their business Wednesday, but it was closed and the Fabling built sign on the door was scraped off. To know that we likely will not get that money back to be able to finish this project, even this summer, maybe even this year, it's beyond stressful. And the Department of Professional and Occupational Regulation gives this advice to people if they feel like they have been scammed or harmed by a contractor. They said first file a complaint with them and then get an attorney.